friends, it is Miss Fushi, and welcome back to Life is Strange. Uh, yes, I am wearing purple lipstick that matches my hair, and yeah, I really like it. So I'm going to wear it for recording today. So if you see a lot of videos with purple lipstick, that's why. But, alright, so where we last left off, we had gone to the diner, and we have to try and get into Frank's RV. So let's see what we can do to make that happen. Good lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Ugh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. What's going on on the TV? The mother, that doesn't explain the recent extreme weather patterns. No, but we have to start with the hypothesis that climate change is a partial cause for the unseasonal weather. That doesn't explain everything, of course. Frankly, we don't know yet. Frankly, we don't know yet. Let me take a look at the photos real quick. Let's see. Okay, so it doesn't look like we need any more pictures for this chapter. Let's see. You killed Kate? Ah. Oh. Maybe we all did. I think we all did. What's this say? Shit. What are the other signs then? Oh, the apocalypse. Hmm, interesting. We've seen a lot of dead birds coming down from the sky, so I really wonder what's going to happen next. So there's Frank. Let me see if there's anything else we can look at. We can only look at the cop. We can't talk Never to him. Never mind me, officer. I'm just here to steal a drug dealer's keys. <gasps> there's Nathan! Can we turn off the music? Can't drop any tunes right now. Keys. Matthias! 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 Stop playing with your toys! He's being noisy. He got a new toy. He loves it. <laughs> Forgot about the fishing wall of fame. Okay, so we already saw that. So I guess we need to go and... He's so noisy. I wonder what Nathan will do. Nathan has time to get drugs from Frank because he was expelled. It doesn't look like we can talk to anybody. This is very interesting. They didn't put a lot of different things in this. Yeah, we can't interact with any of these people. That's so weird. Usually there's so much that we can click on and look at. Uh, we can spill his food or his can. Let's talk to him first and see what happens. You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. Oh. Aiming a gun doesn't make you any sexier. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. Okay, cool. Let's do that then. Let's see, can I talk to the cop? Yes, we can. How now you doing, Maxine? I'm so sorry you had to be up there with Kate when she, you know, just know that we're proud of you for going up there. Thanks, Officer Barry. I know you guys deal with this stuff way more than me, but it is hard to deal with. I'm glad you're representing Black Bull Academy. Let's see. Oh, next. Nathan Prescott. Ah, it's like when we were looking at the password on the computer. Um, let's ask about Nathan. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Ugh. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. Huh. Let's see what that changes for us. See if we can ask him something else. How you doing? Thanks, Off. I'm okay. glad. Next. Prescott deal. Ah. Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. 
Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. Okay. Let's take a look at... Oh, I want some... I'm hungry. I'm gonna have pizza for dinner. I'm recording this on Valentine's Day, guys. <laughs> okay. Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh... Oh, look. Max Amber. Nice outfit. <laughs> By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Let's see. Cop's information. I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit. My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. No. Nope. Now get off my crack, whore. Keep ah. your pie holes shut. You're such a douche. Let's see. I wonder if that'll open anything else up for him. Okay, let's see. Blood oath. Weren't you supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Blood oath? Who? What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. So? Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Okay, let's see if that's something that we can use in this instance. Frank. What the fuck now? Rachel's photo? You know I saw that photo Rachel gave you. Uh, uh, how do you know about that? Huh? Chloe, right? She just told me that one of Rachel's favorite pictures was the one she did for you. Really? Yeah, I mean, that's what I thought. She was just a natural beauty, you know. Wait, wait, let me, let me find it. Here, judge for yourself. Maybe if we spill the can on the picture, he'll get really upset and have to go clean it off? But that sounds horrible to spill it. Let's see. Oh, I just wanted him. to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you. Let's go back and not do that. <coughs> Maybe we should just take the keys? I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. Uh, Max! You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now! Rewind. And we'll still have the keys. Key brought. Now back to Chloe. Run out. Let's leave. <laughs> that worked out great. I'm glad we didn't have to ruin this picture because I would have felt like a total douche. Hey, there's what's her face. Are you shitting me? Aw, should we tell her to move back again? Are you shitting me? Oh, we didn't do it fast enough. Alyssa, watch out! Quick thinking, Max. We help her so many times. Whew. That was close, Alyssa. Okay, Max. This is the third time you've saved me from harm's way. You must be my angel. Don't thank me. I haven't done anything special. I saw you try and save my friend Gate on that roof. The only one who did. While people took camera pics. 
adjusting my camera. I'm sitting with my knees up against the table. Um, I tried. Yep, I tried. And Kate died. Knock that shit off. The whole school saw you trying to talk her down. But nobody could have. You're still a hero, Max. That's not how I feel today, but thanks. We need to hang out more. Drink some wine. I have to go, but let's talk later, cool? Ah. Well, I'm glad we were able to help her so many times. She's not the most interesting character, but she's not bad. Oh, you got something? I should have known. The amazing yeah. Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set. Throw! If we throw towards the road, it's probably gonna get hit by a car. Throw in the parking lot. Get the treat, treat boy! I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace. But let's not waste time. Good. The doggy is busy now, but he might come back. Well, let's give it a try, because I don't want to get the dog hit by a car. He's not a bad dog. He's just protecting his home. We're the ones breaking into it. <laughs> Damn. I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy! Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Just daydreaming. Okay. Now we gotta look around. You scope the area while I hack <laughs> his computer for info. Dog food. I think the doggy likes his bone. Frank is almost a made-for-TV hoarder. This place is nasty. It does look nasty. Frank must have a reason to keep a police raider nearby. That would be so cool to take this baby on the road with Chloe. It would be cool, but we're not gonna steal his car. Or at least I hope not. Pompidou? <laughs> for reals? That's a poodle's name. Pompidou the dog. He's so tough. That's a cool looking thing there. Crappy wife out here. Let's take- I doubt Frank is trying out for the Arcadia Bay Brewers. Let's see. The archetypal filthy guy dishes. Ugh. Dishes are the worst. Good to know Frank has a knife lying around. Let's see. Candy bar. Of course Frank gets the munchies. Nice rig. Glad Frank treats something here with respect. Frank must spend all his drug money on baggies. <sighs> Recycle, dude. Seriously? A sink? How can somebody live like this? That's pretty nasty. An RV could be totally cool. Whoa, what the hell is he doing with that dog? <sighs> Stop it. Yeah. Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. I wonder what that's for. Are these for Frank, or is he selling them? Or both? Does he just sell pot, or what? That's a pretty extreme lighter. That is a pretty extreme lighter. What's that? Is Frank going to deal online now? Newbie's Guide to a Web Business. Joy in the Dark Net. I could pry this vent open with the right tool. I wonder why we should open it. There's probably a reason for that. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. He really does love his I animal. I cannot believe he would wear a collar and a furry mask. You're dumb. <laughs> he must really like his dog. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Let's see, what do we got in here? Ooh, Frank's stash. Ooh. Let's see. We need something to pry open that vent. I wonder what we could use. Let's see. There was a knife. 
This is almost as good as a set of keys. Can we take his bat yet? No, I want to take the bat. Because if he tries to sneak in, we could do that. You didn't tell me you took photos of Frank in action. I'm seriously ignoring you. <laughs> oh. Horses. Nothing here. Let's go back. We can do the other vent. Before the knife breaks. My blade will open any portal. Ooh, what's that, Max? What is that? Be careful. Oh, man. Rachel and Frank's dog. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. Let's see what this says. Frankie B, hope you read this first thing in the morning. Sorry about last night. I was being a monstrous bitch and took it out on you. And poor Pompadou. There's a lot of weird shit going on in my life, and sometimes I feel like I'm never going to get out of Arcadia Bay. Thank God for you. You're one of the best things I have here, and I smile when I think of us together. Let's just drive out of here forever. Love you always, heart. R.A. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Maybe she really did love Frank. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. She was a really pretty girl. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Yeah. Hmm. Trouble in paradise. Frank, that was not cool what you did. And don't blame the drugs. You actually scared me and I thought you'd never chill out. I've never seen you act that way and the next time will be the last. I'm a Leo and we don't look back. I care about you, us, so maybe we need to break our routine. Exo, Rachel. So I wonder if she really did care about him. Did we open this one yet? No more secrets. Hmm. I think we pretty much looked in all the places. Let's see if there's anything else we can do. Maybe we should go talk to Chloe guys, what do you think? Let's see, anywhere else we can use the knife? Let's mention the account book. That makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years. My mother gloms on the stepfucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! Who hasn't? Fuck everybody! Hey! Chloe! Now he can't get into his thing. <laughs> He's gonna figure it out. He's gonna figure it out. Goodness. Chloe's so mad. Don't get in a car accident, Chloe. Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. <laughs> Let's see. If I tell her to grow up, she doesn't seem like a very mature person. Maybe nobody's fault? It's just life. Shit happens. It's nobody's fault. Blah, 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 as Mr. Jefferson would say. And, and Kate Marsh... Yes, Kate Marsh killed herself. She's dead. Such sad, okay? That doesn't make me feel better about my fucked up life, get it? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? William? You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. 
Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. You're still here. You don't want to hear this, but you're still here. Alive. With me. And that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. And Rachel needs you. Goodness, Chloe, she gets so pissed off so easy. Like, I want to help her. I really do. Damn, Chloe. And all those dead birds on campus. Holy crap. It's okay, Max. Max needs friends too. It's not like she can go around fixing everyone else's problems and not feel so sad and alone. Oh my god. What is happening now? Oh. Can Max jump through time in photographs? Holy shit. Oh my god! Use A, D keys and left mouse, right mouse button until you find the sweet spot. What? So you can like try and get the right part of the picture? Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Not until I see it first! You know the rules, Dad! Max, tell him! Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... Uh... Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Whoa. Well, I might just allow this one into the family album. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook. William the is here. Camp, Daddy. Yes, and we can't Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that well, far back in time? You mean pancakes? In France, they call them crepes. I'm 18 years like old inside my 13-year-old self. If you want to eat. How? We. Oui. I volunteer to break the eggs. That's that picture. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. That's true. Now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. Just make me look young. Holy crap. So how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right. Like you're the real cook here? Wow. I am when your mom is away. Man. I remember Chloe reading this. But not after today. Can we change? I'll let her know that. Wait, what did that say? Man, I remember Chloe reading this, but not after today. It says girl gamers. I like that a lot. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. There's a snow globe? That's a cool snow dough. Yeah. Can we change it so he doesn't die? Hello? Hey, honey. <gasps> Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. Uh... What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come <gasps> no, pick no, you no, up. No, 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 no
Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious... Whoa! It's all blurry here. Like I can't step out of the photographic rounds. That's a dollar for the swear jar! You mean your college fund? Where's his keys? Where's his keys? Where's your keys? I have to steal your keys. Uh... I can't go up the stairs, can I? No. Uh -huh. You can't hide from me? No, you're not gonna die, good sir. I'm taking your keys. Come on. Come on. Take Score. those keys. Hello. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. Yeah. We're going to work at the two whales. Let's see. I can still draw there. What? Oh, I didn't know you had there to get groceries. Go. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse cool. to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Okay. Now I'm excuse guessing that means ladies, he can't come. I have come, to go rescue yonder queen go at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast you upon. Oh man. He'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean my your keys. college fund? Keys, please. Hopefully he can't find him there. I hope so. What a mess we made. I remember those cool drawings I did with Chloe. Shit, where are those keys? Another Don't... dollar for the swear jar! Don't You're find them. You're bankrupting me! Don't find them. Oh, crap. I knew this thing would come in handy. How did my keys get in here? No, 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 no. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad. Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, no. you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. No, 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 no. Can't we go back? Oh, crap. That's so scary and sad. You'll be grateful for that someday. All right, we have the Shit, keys. Where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Hope he can't find him. I know I had those keys right here. I know it. They're gone. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys. They're gone. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can God. take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes and, and there'll be plenty of room for you and, and Joyce and groceries and, and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Is that gonna actually make a Max, difference? Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. Is that actually gonna change anything? Oh my God. Did we make this better? Did we did we ruin something else by fixing this? Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? All my friends in LA told me that Oregon was Max. Be wet and cold every day. But Never, like Maxine. So that's why she was laughing so hard. I know. Sorry, Mad Is Max. <laughs> You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girl's California potty and smoke a peace pipe? I think Max is high. She's acting like so weird. 
You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like whatever, bitch. Warren, he hooked up with Stella? What did we change? And what happened to Chloe? Oh no, Th this is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Chloe. So is Chloe a student? Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is gonna be a long episode <laughs> because I don't see a good time to cut this yet. Oh my gosh. I did not see that coming. Like at all. I did not see that coming, us being able to go into pictures. Holy crap! Did we make life better or worse by saving William? The birds are still there. We're wearing different clothes. They're not Rachel Amber's clothes. Did we make any difference in the existence of Rachel Amber? Like in her being Chloe's friend? Did we ever leave? And now David's a bus driver? How did we change his career by doing that? Oh God. The environment is really getting screwed over. And I wonder if that's our fault. For the one time we did something and we saved Chloe's life, like we started all of this. Please be alive, Chloe. Or please exist, Chloe. Max Caulfield, taking a break after taking Seattle by storm, huh? Hmm. We thought we'd never see you again after you left for the big city. No. I'd never do that to Chloe. Speaking of, I know she's been dying to see you. Hold on. Chloe! You have a visitor! Oh no. Oh god, what happened to Chloe? Oh god. Did she get in like a horrible car accident or something? Oh no. Is she happier that way? Oh gosh, that is one heck of an ending to the third episode. Jesus! So now Max can go through pictures. Hope that doesn't have any bearing in the pictures that we have taken and failed to take. And now we're part of the Vortex Club and Chloe is paralyzed, it looks like. She had a tube in her throat, so I don't know if she can speak. And I don't know what happened to her, but oh my gosh. Let me see if we can see the preview to the next. Oh, we can look this over. This is going to be a really long episode. I hope that's okay with you guys. <laughs> I didn't see a time where it was appropriate to cut it. So most people kissed Chloe and sided with Chloe. Yeah, we didn't kill or hurt Frank's dog. He really loved his dog. I don't think that would have been a good idea. Chloe has David's gun. 
Lisa is alive. Lisa the plant is alive. We didn't help Warren with his exam. Not on the Vortex Club party list. Didn't change the Vortex Club party list. We didn't do anything. Didn't erase the cop's message. Helped Alyssa. You warned the homeless woman. Most people didn't warn her. I wonder what bearing that'll have. You took a photo in the past. You left a mark on the fireplace. So we did. Most people didn't. That's really cool that we found that. Okay. Here we go. Literally the end of the world party. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys, so that was episode three of Life is Strange. That was very exciting, and the fact that we have now opened the door and the ability to travel through, like, pictures is so cool! Um, and that opens up the things that we can do, and hopefully we can fix what's going on with Chloe's life. It seems like, regardless of what we do, stuff that's better for the world is bad for Chloe. And vice versa. It's almost like she's the focus or the catalyst of this whole thing. And I don't know if that's true or if we're going to have to make a decision regarding Chloe because it seems that way. But we're going to find out in the next episode. If you guys are enjoying this series, do me a favor. Leave a thumbs up down below to show your support for the series. Leave a comment. Let's discuss this mind-blowing discovery in this episode. And subscribe for more. And I will see you guys on the next episode of Life is strange. Bye-bye. <laughs>